Alright, what's going on guys? Mr. Clasher here. Welcome back to another Clash of Clans gameplay commentary. And I know for the last couple of videos, I've been having a lot of Clan War videos. And if you guys don't really enjoy or really like my Clan War videos, I do apologize for that. I know not everybody likes Clan Wars, but um, it's been, you know, my main clan has been having wars. Then uh, Proud Gamers, our second family clan, which this is the recap for Proud Gamers because they had a random war. And um, that day when they had this war, I wasn't actually on because I really couldn't get on. And yeah, so they actually did pretty well against this clan. So you guys will see a couple of replays. But yeah, so I want to say really quick, thank you. I mean, this is huge. Thank you for over 100 likes on my last video for Clan Wars. I don't even know how we hit 100 likes, like how we smashed it, but we managed to hit 100 likes, and that's pretty awesome. So, um, huge thank you for that. Unbelievable. I can't believe, you know, 100 likes is a lot, at least on my channel. So, really, really do appreciate about that. But anyway, so this is the most real offense attack by Nicholas, and it looks like he, last war, he used the same strategy. He uses four golems and the rest wizards. So it's not a bad strategy, but it's it, I mean it seems to work out for him for two stars usually. So last war he got two stars as well. And this is the most heroic defense. So let's see what this player does. So he obviously drops his giants. There was a giant bomb. And he drops a heal and a rage right there just to heal his giants up. And huge mistake what he does. He doesn't lure out the clan castle troops. So that was a huge mistake. And because somebody donated a dragon i believe it was ace or somebody um the dragon is going to destroy all the troops all his giants and i believe i'm just going to start destroying his king pretty soon so yeah that was a huge mistake and looks like the giants are going to die in just a second i'm um, yeah they just died and looks like the king is getting healed but once the rage disappears the healer will not heal him enough um, and he will die and the healer will die as well. So this was a pretty good defense by Mr. Awesome 12 um, Yeah, pretty good defense. So This weekend I, real quick guys Actually, there's gonna be a huge collaboration at like pretty big one It's gonna be a lot of pretty well-known youtubers and uh, I'm gonna talk about it later But yeah, this I think Saturday or something um yeah, we're going to have a huge collaboration. I think we're going to do a war or something. So I'll talk about it later. I'm going to down the line when it gets closer. But yeah, huge collab this weekend. And uh, so because I'm leaving, I got invited. I don't know about my main clan having war. Maybe I could take my mini, which is a Town Hall 7 account. Not too bad. I almost have all level 7 walls, you know. So I'm almost near max Town Hall 7 on that account. Pretty close. And I could have that in the war. So... You know, because my Town Hall 7 is a pretty low account, my team could maybe get a clan with, you know, not as hard bases and stuff. So, yeah, but anyway, looks like this attacker, Vincent Ovik, or I think that's how you pronounce it, attacks with giants and all sorts of kind of troops. He's got barbarians, archers, wall breakers, a couple of wizards, minions, a few hog riders, but this base was pretty bad. I mean, it was just super easy to destroy. And I bet the Hog Riders would have had an easy time destroying this base. So, but yeah, this base was very, very bad. And looks like the player just wanted to protect his town hall with like multiple pieces of walls. But that didn't really work out because dragons can easily overpass that. And yeah, so anyway, this was a pretty good raid by Vince. And good job, bro, if you're watching this video. But yeah, so Proud Gamers had another war. They just uh, actually won, which is this. It was a pretty good battle. Um, pretty easy win. They didn't really face a too tough of a clan for them, you know, as a challenge. So they did get the W. But yeah, looks like Vincent's going to destroy that town hall and get that three star. So the last one is by Mr. Stud. And he's going to drop down a level three dragon. And he's going to drop down all his other dragons, all his other nine dragons pretty soon. And the only thing I would have actually, if I was him, I would have carried two rage instead of two two heal spells and one rage. I would have carried two rage and one heal. But hey, as long as it works, it's fine. I mean, if it was him, I would I would definitely choose that. But yeah, 
So anyway, this was a pretty awesome, you know, ray, very low air defenses for this Town Hall 8. And many of their bases looked pretty rushed when I came and recorded. So, yeah, but anyway, uh, looks like Vincent's doing a very good job. So, I'm sorry if you guys are sick of the Clan Wars. I promise I'm not going to have Clan Wars every single video uh, for sure. But it's just been having a lot of Clan Wars. I've been posting a lot of Clan Wars. So, if you do enjoy Clan Wars, I'm happy. If you guys don't enjoy the Clan Wars, I do apologize about that. But it's not like I do Clan Wars 24-7 on my channel. So, yeah, anyway, hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. Um, after this Dragon Raid, you guys will see the score. And we nailed them pretty badly. Proud uh, gamers did. So my second account wasn't in the war because I opted out. Since I don't play much in that second account, I do once in a while maybe get on and collect some loot, but not much. So it looks like Mr. Stutt is going to get the 3-star. And yeah, so you guys will see the score in a second. But anyway... If we could smash 40 to or 45 likes, that'd be awesome. And I just want to say thank you to uh, for 100 likes on my last video. That's unbelievable. But yeah, so if we could smash 45 likes for this video. That would be amazing. Here's the score, 71 to 56. And as always, I'll see you all on my next video.